Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today we're tackling a challenge that many developers encounter when working with JHipster 4 and Angular 2. Our viewer is looking for guidance on how to integrate a third-party JavaScript library that isn't available on NPM and lacks a DTS file. They want to know how to directly include this JavaScript file in their project, especially since the usual import method in Ven.ts only works for NPM installed libraries. Let's dive into this question and explore some effective solutions together. All right, guys, we're back with another technical video. Today, I'll be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully you find your solution that you need. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy like me, and hopefully you get to that resolution. Now, let's continue on to the video. To use a third-party JavaScript library in your JHipster 4 project, first, you need to include the library file in your project directory. Next, you need to modify the Angular JSON file to ensure that the library is included in your build process. Open angular.json and add the path to your library under the scripts section. After that, you need to declare the library in your TypeScript files. Since there is no .dts file, you can declare it as any to avoid TypeScript errors. Now, you can use the library in your Angular components. Just call the functions or methods provided by the library as needed. Finally, run your application to see the library in action. Use the command npm start to start your jhipster application. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To use third-party JavaScript libraries with jhipster4, you can simply link the library in your index.html file. Then, in your TypeScript code, declare the library at the top of your file. For example, you can import the component from Angular and call a function from your library in the constructor. Keep in mind, this won't provide auto-completion. If you want auto-completion, you can create your own interfaces and declaration files, but this is optional. The main goal is to get it working. I hope that video helped find the resolution you're looking for. If it did, guys, I'd appreciate it if you could hit subscribe. Until the next time that you need more technical help, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.